All right, friends, I am hopping on here before the intro even rolls because I was messing with a new camera. It's going to be great, but I'm learning it. And I actually had to transfer footage back and forth from my phone. So the resolution will not be as good because I didn't save it to the SD card, but I figured it out. This footage should look really clear, but you'll see a difference. But don't worry, it is fixed. I know how to fix it. <laughs> Hello friends and welcome to Vlogmas day two. Here we go, it's day two. Thank you for all the love on day one. I was tired, I was not myself. And you're looking at a person who got six full hours of sleep last night. I am super excited. I also hope that today you see a difference in stabilization and all things techie because we're actually on my DGI Osmo Action and I love it. You also get a wider perspective, which I'm super excited about. And I think I'm gonna be using this camera for all of Vlogmas. I can also take it into stores. It's small, it's discreet. We're gonna have a blast. So that is what's going on right now. I am setting off alarms. That's our refrigerator. And Steven just texted me. He worked from home today, but he said he was going to scarf up dinner which is amazing. He knows that this week is super busy between traveling. I also had a meeting today from 11.30 to 3.30. So it's just been busy. It's now a little after four. I just got home, did some snuggles with Bubba's, tried to get him outside, but it's a windstorm and he is not having it. He's already back in here laying down and chilling. Right, Bubby? Well, he's currently licking himself, so I will not turn the camera around because no one needs to see that. This is a family friendly channel. So I am so appreciative for all of you and all the love you gave Vlogmas Day 1. I wasn't quite myself. I was running on very little sleep, but I had a blast filming it and editing it and then also reading and answering comments. Let's think about day number two on our advent of kindness. Day two is start reading a new book. I just started mine actually a couple days ago while I was at the airport. I'm reading Brene Brown's Atlas of the Heart. It is phenomenal. I highly recommend it. I linked it yesterday. That is my new book and I just think it's fantastic. I actually just bought seven more copies for my leadership team because I want them to all have a copy of it. So that is what's going on. I'm going through some mail. Nothing super exciting. What's happening in the mail today? I got a pair of black joggers. So fun, so exciting. But one thing I did pick up which I'm excited about that it came, is I love the Nike Down winter coats. And I actually found this one that has like a little bit of a sheen to it. So I picked up this one and I'm really happy with it. I love how long it is. I love like the look. I also like this little Nike hook in the back. It's super cute. If you're interested, let me know. But I just tried it on. I love it. <gasps> Yes, I got a solid black coat so you and I can match. You have a black coat, I have a black coat. All right, that is what's happening. I'm going to get changed into com some comfy clothes. I'm going to follow this dog around because I love him too much. What, 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 what? The sous chef is back. I am. You wanna see what I cooked up for dinner? Yes. So I got pumpkin bagels, but those are for my breakfast. Um, and this English curry chickens for tomorrow with rice. Uh, but for today, we have a delicious meal of yellow potatoes that go in the microwave, frozen chicken, or <laughs> frozen corn, and a delicious barbecue rotisserie chicken. You really outdid yourself. Or we could have frozen peas. <clears throat> well, potatoes are already a starch. Let's go with peas. Although peas, are they a starch? No, they're a legume. Let's go with peas. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go with the peas. Okay. So. Look, these potatoes cook in eight minutes. Yeah. <laughs> so that is what I'm making for dinner. And you also got some stuff from 
from the P.O. box. Oh my goodness. This is not for you. It's not for you. Oh my goodness. This Christmas card is so cute. Thank you, John, for the Christmas card. First of all, look at these doggies. Kirk and Jacqueline. This is the cutest thing ever. They sent me a spice advent calendar. I've never seen this. A day of pepper, a salt, spices. This is the coolest thing. We got a spice advent calendar. Oh, wow. You should not have sent anything, but that is the cutest thing ever. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Jacqueline. It means the world to us, so add it to the advent calendars. Alrighty, friends, let's open some advent calendars. Laura actually texted me today, and she loved yesterday's lotion. She also loved the size, just the same things that I commented on. So we are on day two. We're right here. So they're like little, oh my gosh, it smells amazing. They're like little bath bombs. That is cute. All right, let's go ahead and open Rituals Day 2. Day 2 is right here. Oh, uh, see, some of them are in like larger slots. We got a Repair Natural Lip Care. Wait, can we talk about this packaging? Watch this. It's a push button. And then the lip balm comes out. That is cool because then you don't have to ever worry about it coming open in your bag. All right. Beekman. Day two. What we got is a cuticle cream. Let's go over to... Day two, Tango. Bubby, do you want to meet Tango? Bubby, looky. Looky, looky. It's Tango. Why is it not me? Bubby, it's Tango. Yeah, whatever. I know him. Not interested. All right, we'll put Tango next to Bailey. Look at that. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's go. Hi, 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 oh stink pot. How oh, stink pot. Pour some sugar on me. We got the sparkle pops. They are like, they kind of like have like a pop or like pop rock vibe to them, like a fizzy vibe. All right, day two. Have a holly dolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. Oh wait, not every day is chocolate. This one's a little peppermint candy. This reminds me of my grandmother so much. You are an amazing, amazing spouse. Hey, I went to the post office too. Twice, because the first time it was closed, it was so early in the morning. The sacrifices he makes to the post office, not just once, but twice. All right, those advent calendars are, oh, oh wait, 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 wait. While we're at it, you should open Daniel's Tea. Steven is in much better spirits today. Yes. Work from home did me well. Um, okay, so number two. Um, I'm missing it. So, oh, here it is. Okay. Organic cream of Earl Grey. Are you so, excited about that? Not really, but it's sort of. They have it every year. We have him every year. Well, yeah. There's we don't get tired of him. He's a good doggy. Earl Grey hot. I would like a swat of tea. Bubba's, you had a little accent there. 
Oh my goodness. Oh, did he? No, you can open it with him. Oh, well, we already had dinner, so I guess this is dessert. What is it? What is it? Right here. Two. Oh, we ripped the door! No, we didn't. He can't pull them out. What color? What? You didn't even it's show us green. it. Green. Last night, or in day one of Vlogmas, you saw that there was like a little event that happened. About 200 of you showed up to watch the Kelly Clarkson Christmas special together. And we talked about outfits and songs. And it was literally like hanging out with friends. It was such a good time. I told you this year's Vlogmas, this idea around simplicity and like getting back to what this is all about originally and that's connection and building bonds every week there's going to be some sort of live event because human connection is one of the most powerful powerful things and it truly was hanging out with friends and it was really special they're not always going to be that late i can't control what time that special was on but each week of vlogmas there's going to be alive on Instagram for us just to connect. Sometimes we're going to journal together. Sometimes we are going to just chit chat. Other times we have other activities we might do. They'll be previewed. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about it. And I couldn't help, especially knowing day two is reading a new book. And I am currently in the Atlas of the Heart. This quote about connection from Brene Brown is so beautiful, so I'm going to read it to you. So often, when we feel lost, adrift in our lives, our first instinct is to look out into the distance to find the nearest shore. But that shore, that solid ground, is within us. The anchor we are searching for is connection, and it is internal. To form meaningful connections with others, we must first connect with ourselves. But to do either, we must first establish a common understanding of the language of emotion and human experience. So I think it's so cool how much that quote resonates with me. The thought that I put in around the advent calendar this year, the thought and intention behind this channel in general, is about connecting with ourselves, getting to know ourselves better in order to connect fully with others. And I think we have fostered that beautifully here. And it's something I'm so incredibly proud of. So many of you messaged me after we hung out for 40 minutes late last night, laughing, talking, maybe a few tears with a couple sad Christmas songs and lots of chit chat about her dresses and gowns that were beautiful. Uh, that ultimately it was feeling like hanging out with friends. And Kelly Clarkson's Christmas album this year is called When Christmas Comes Around. And if you've not listened to the album, there are sad songs, there are happy songs. And the purpose of the album is to encompass every emotion that people are feeling. We know that we are all in really different places, physically, mentally, financially, spiritually, and People are feeling all sorts of different things coming out of everything that we've done. Some people are happy and content and really satisfied while others feel behind the eight ball and struggling or are going through trials and grieving loss. And just because the holidays he are here, don't erase it. And it's okay to feel all of those emotions at different times and I don't want Vlogmas to be isolated into one feeling. There are there are people experiencing different things, but no matter what we're experiencing, we can all come together for connection. And no matter how you are feeling, connection makes you feel better. Whether you're feeling lost or happy, connection elevates both of those feelings. And I just want to connect. So the intention behind these live moments we're going to be doing on Instagram is to truly connect, to meet everyone where they are. 
it requires nothing except your Instagram account. And if you're watching YouTube, you can easily have an Instagram account. And I'm just really excited to do it. There's been a really thoughtful process around this Vlogmas. And oddly enough, it's been more thoughtful and intentional than previous Vlogmases. Being thoughtful around connection and intention has taken far more planning than many other Vlogmases. But I'm really excited about it and I'm excited to really deepen this community and do some great work together and share that. I am the most excited I've ever been for Vlogmas. I could feel it yesterday, even though I was exhausted, that there is a genuine excitement and like fire in me to make this one really special for all of us. And I don't know, I'm just really happy. I was going to do something silly tonight, but I think I'm actually going to hold on to it for tomorrow. And I'm really excited to see this video footage. So I might start editing in a little bit. Maybe we'll do a little bit more catching up as well, but I love you all. Things are about to get wild and crazy here. I'm gonna do some laundry. And I'm gonna read Martha Stewart Living. This is also reading a new book. A really fulfilling day two of our Advent of Kindness. Um, but I'm going to end Vlogmas day two right here. I'm excited for what we have planned for tomorrow. And I'm gonna end it like I end all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time which will be tomorrow. Bye-bye, friends.